What's going on YouTube family? Hope you guys have been good and are having a great week as usual. We've got another pickup from Ame Leon Dor this week. I hope my channel isn't looking like I'm some kind of ALD freak. They've just been consistently putting out heat and man, I can't help myself. Anyways, we've got the Ame Leon Dor New Balance 993s in today. These are the brown and green or beef and broccoli joints. I don't usually pick up sneakers with a black midsole. I'm more of a white or off-white midsole kind of guy, but I think the black kind of works with this colorway. I've also swapped out the black laces for cream ones and I think they look loads better now. As always, my laces are from Factory Knots. I use the 120cm New Balance laces in cream. They ship internationally too, so if you guys want to pick up the same, they should be good to help you out. But let's get right into it guys. Three ways to style these Ame Leon Dor New Balance 993s in brown and green. And then we'll get into the details and sizing advice towards the end. First up, we're going with some muted earth tones. We've got a Jacquemus on Jacquemus fit with an oversized green logo hoodie and wheat cargo pants. A cream tee for the layering and an Ame Leon Dor Yankees chain stitch logo cap in olive. Going with lighter tones to kind of contrast the darker tones on the Ame Leon Dor 993s. Next up, going for darker tones with that green and black combo. We've got a vintage green Kuji jumper, white tee for the layering, black Fizvim Hakama pants, and a black beanie to add into all that color blocking. A gardens and seeds tote for some light contrast and color pop, with that green logo also matching the green on the vintage Gucci. Finally, tying it all together with the Ame Leon Dor 993s in brown and green. Lastly, for look three, we're going full winter with the new Pangaea flower down vest in black. Shouts to Pangaea for this piece. Essentials brown jumper, AMI cargo pants in black, and a white beanie and white tee for some color contrast too. With the midsole of the Ame Leon Dor 993s being black, I definitely tried playing around with darker black tones this time. Of course, mixing in some hits of brown too. Now, let's get down to the details. We've got this special edition Ame Leon Dor and New Balance box in this beautiful olive green and yellow. The 993s come equipped with two laces, the original black ones, and this beef and broccoli inspired colorway. Now getting into the shoe, we've got a dark brown base mixed with mesh and suede paneling. Dark green perforated paneling, a green New Balance logo on the side, a black outsole with New Balance's absorbed foam technology, Ame Leon Dor logos on the back in black, more Ame Leon Dor logos on the insides, with a green tongue area, and my own cream laces again from Factory Knots. As for sizing guys, New Balance generally fits larger as compared to Nike's. So as a general rule, if this is your first time purchasing from New Balance, I'd suggest going down half a size from your usual Nike size. After the lace swap, I'm really liking these 993s. They are my first pair of New Balance 993s too. I think this is a pair that really grows on you over time. Plus with the upper being dark brown and the midsole being black, you could beat these up and they're still gonna last you a really long time. Just in case you weren't aware too, Teddy Santis, the founder of Ame Leon Dor, is also the new creative director at New Balance, specifically for the Made in USA line. That's why there have been so many collabs with Ame and New Balance. He's set to release his first collection in 2022 and has already been working on a 990 with a version 6 coming out. I'm super excited for that and you should be expecting to see more New Balances from Teddy and Ame Leon Dor in 2022. 
But with that being said guys, that's gonna be it for me today. I hope you enjoyed this week's video and styling. Let me know which is your favorite look. As always, if you enjoyed the video, please drop a like, share or comment. It does help me out with the YouTube algorithm. If you enjoyed my content and would like to support me, please hit that subscribe button. Also, if you want more content from me throughout the week, don't forget to check out my Instagram. I'm also on TikTok now, so don't forget to check that out too. And yeah, much love guys. Peace. See you guys again soon.